crunch in fact has hit India's flower industry quite significantly. Priya is joining in with more details on this. Let's go across to her. One large industry that's facing the heat of demonetization is India's flower industry. In fact, we learned from top officials in the role of Flower Millers Federation of India that represents the association of flower millers in the country that flower production has been hit by about 40% over the last 50 days. And that's primarily because companies are procuring much lesser than they, what they used to do earlier. In fact, we understand that companies manufacturing bread, biscuits as well as noodles have reduced procurement on an average of about 30%. Now, the average flour production has dropped to about 10 to 11 lakh tons per day from 15 to 16 lakh tons per day. And what's also interesting is that flour mills are operating at a 20 to 25 percent capacity. But what essentially companies are looking at doing at this point in time is minimizing costs. Do remember the flour prices have increased by 1.5 to 2 rupees uh, per kilo. And therefore, companies are adopting a wait and watch approach before they normalize a procurement levels, is what we understand. In fact, over the last one to two months, we have spoken to several companies and they have indicated uh, you know, at production cuts going ahead but in fact when we reached out to them on our query ITC said demand levels have for consumer staples have recovered over the last uh, few weeks in fact Britannia said that their flower consumption remains fairly consistent over the last quarter while Nestle did not respond to our query. Priya thank you very much.